Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Andrea and this is Beauty with Andy. So as you can see, we're in a different location. We're still in my flat. Um, I just thought I would film in my lounge just because why not? Um, so today we're going to be doing a kind of like when I got the birch box, it's the August birch box and the free box. I got quite a bit of skincare in it, so I thought I would do a try on with you guys as I have done a try on with the makeup part of it. Um, so yeah, this one was the free box and then this one was the August birch box. So let me so let me get the skincare out. I'm not going to be doing a um mask i got a mask in here as well but i am really excited to try this so it's the eyebrush eye brush it's the eyelash and eyebrow serum it's the jamaican black castor oil and it's by the company sunny isle so we'll be using that but just on the brows today i want to see what it feels like on the brows before i put it on the lashes my whole eye area is very sensitive and I'm not too sure about putting it on the lashes so I just want to see what it looks like on the brow and it's supposed to help your brows grow um, and I'm all about that thick full brow so yeah I'd love to see some growth on my brows with this so we're going to be using that over there's a three month supply so, so over the next three months I'm going to be bringing you updates and you'll probably be able to see if it's working anyway when I do my videos right so that's that I'll bring you monthly updates as well so yeah um, we're in September now so the next monthly update on that will be October so we're September the 14th when I'm filming this video although it won't go up on September the 14th this i am really interested to try it's the vq pineapple glow serum um antioxidant now this isn't full size 30 mils full size and i think it said it was um like 19 pound for a full size one which isn't too bad i paid 28 pound for my ole henriksen um serum not serum ole henriksen primer and it does remind me of that a little bit it smells only slightly a pineapple i put some on the back of my mum's hand because i was showing her what i got in the boxes and she couldn't distinguish the smell i said what does what does it smell of mum and she's like it does have a scent to it but i can't i can't distinguish what it smells of me personally i really like pineapple so i could tell straight away it smells of pineapple so we're going to be trying that that's makeup that's makeup this i'm going to try that when i have a shower um so obviously we can't try that today yeah i'll let i'll let you know what i think about that one uh, right so then we're going into this birch box and we're going to try everything that i can so we're going to try this, this Grace and Stella Rose Spray. It's a hydrating facial spray. Um, so we'll try that. We're not going to be trying the mask today. I want to do that in a separate video. Um, we've got the highlighter. I've already tried that on. I really, really like this highlighter, guys. Um, and then we've got an eye cream to try as well. So we've got a fair few um, skincare products to try. So yeah let's get started let's get this party started um well this skincare party started right so we've got four items to try i'm going to get my mirror now um and then i'll zoom you in so i've cleansed my face um because it says about this you, you need to have a freshly clean face um and we're going to put this on first right so i'm back so september's birch box i wasn't impressed with at all guys um it was mainly filled with samples like really really small samples the only thing that kind of redeemed it was the lipstick which i've now lost i'm sure it's in the flat somewhere i, I did take it to my mum's and used it there 
but then I remember bringing it home and normally I'm leaving lipsticks in jackets or bags. Can anyone else relate to that? I leave lipsticks places and then I can't find them. And it's the same with these things. I leave them places and I'm like, oh, where's my Charlotte Tilbury? I'm really, really panicking because it's so expensive. Um, but yeah, I'm sure I'll find it. Um, and if not, then I'll just have to take that loss on the head. Um, but that redeemed it. Like that lipstick's worth £12 and um, the box is £13. Um, I mean, I am using the products, don't get me wrong. I just would have liked a little bit more for my first box because that was initially my first box. And, you know, I was saying to myself, if, um, if it doesn't get better, like when I get this August box and this free birch box, then I'm just going to cancel it. I'm not going to cancel it at this point. I believe they really did redeem themselves and the customer services at birch box is really, really good. Um, compared to some other subscription boxes I've had to deal with. They sent me my replacement boxes out, no questions asked. Um, and then they're going to look into what actually happened um, and what the courier did with the original box. I think what he did is left it outside my flat on the doorstep. Now what they do, they have to actually take a picture. Um, so they take a picture of you know where they've left your parcel and mine was showing on a doorstep and it did look like my doorstep but I didn't receive it and he didn't like knock on the door so um, he's at fault why for not doing that so they need to take that up with they need to take that up with the actual courier service but yeah I've got my boxes and I'm happy with them I actually prefer um, the free box rather than August um, birch box but August birch box was better than September's and I know you're going to have uh, months where you don't like it but September's birch box in my mind wasn't a great box um, a lot of the products that I'm thinking about well not a lot but a couple of the products I'm thinking about putting in a giveaway um, so yeah let's get into this anyway um, Right, so what does it say? Wash your face with a mild soap to remove all traces of makeup, oil and dirt from eyelashes and eyebrows. Dip mascara wand into Sunny Isle Jamaican Black Castor Oil Eyebrows and Eyelash Growth Serum Tapping off any excess oil. It is important to apply a thin layer so use a clean tissue to dab away drips from the wand if necessary. Brush the oil evenly through your eyebrows from inner to outer tip. Then use the wand to apply the oil to your. Brush the oil through your eyebrows from inner to outer tip. Then use the wand to apply the oil to your eyelashes, just as you would mascara from root to tip. Leave the oil on overnight and rinse off with a mild soap in the morning before you apply your makeup moisturizer. Right, so. You have to do this in the evening. I'm going to leave it then and I'll do it tonight. Um, and I'll refilm this video tonight. Well, this portion of the video. Um, as it's supposed to be on uh, overnight. So we'll leave that. Um, shall we do the spray? Grace and Stella Rose spray. Just as a bit of a refresh. Apparently, this um, helps with flyaway hairs as well. So it's... Obviously it rose, I'm not a big fan of rose spray guys. I was saying in the birch box unboxing that I did used to have um, a Mario Badescu spray that was rose spray and I didn't like that either. So I'm just going to Oh that sprayer is fantastic. Yes, that spray is really, really nice. I'll definitely use this bottle afterwards um, because I really do like that sprayer. Some's got in me air, so let's... Um, ooh. Right, I'm going to let that dry and then I'm going to come back and we'll use the VQ serum and then we'll use the eye cream. Right, so that dried down pretty quick and it's really, really nice. It feels moisturising. What does it say on here? Hydrating facial spray, that's why it feels so moisturising. I've not got moisturiser on. Um, so yeah, that feels really, really moisturising. 
Grace and Stella, I still don't know much about them because I've not had time to research the brand. Does anyone know about Grace and Stella and what are your thoughts on them? I would love to have a chat with you guys about that. Right, so let's zoom in. Right, okay. So, VQ Pineapple Glow Serum. So, it's not really a serum, it's more of a moisturiser. I don't like the way that's looking. Um, it's more of a moisturiser. It says it's a lightweight morning evening serum made with pineapple extracts, antioxidants, multi-molecular, hyaluronic acid, pro-vitamin B5 and golden light reflectors to hydrate and enhance your natural glow in three to four drops. It reminds me so much of the Olay Henriksen primer because um, that you can use as skincare as well. So we're gonna we're gonna test this. Um, mirror. So that's just one drop. So that's three to four drops. I don't think I'll need three to four drops. Put another quite big drop here. I didn't put any on the chin, maybe another drop then. Now, if I like this, I'll um, I'll buy it, because you can buy it on the Birchbox shop. Um, and a 15ml deluxe sample size should last me a while. Yeah, it should last a while. Oh, it smells so so nice guys yeah it's definitely looking glowy but I don't know if that's because I sprayed the facial spray as well because that to me looks like it's got some kind of glowing it doesn't say I don't think it doesn't say that it does um, it just says it's hydrating facial spray have I got the card still? Can I have a look then? Is it in this one? Primes, tones and moisturising for a fresh, plumped and youthful complexion. So I guess it does have some kind of um, glowness to it. Glowness, is that even a word? I wouldn't get very far at Scrabble, would I? Um, so yeah we've got that and then the last thing is this I have tried some Balance Me products in the past and I've really liked them this is a 7ml tube um, so we're just going to pop some of this on that should be enough for both eyes I'll be bringing you updates on how I like them I don't like the smell of this Smells like it's got chamomile in it, but chamomile, doesn't it reduce redness? Um, and my eyes are looking pretty puffy at the moment. I didn't sleep a wink last night. Um, I just thought I would do this with you guys now. I'm a little bit, um, a little bit gutted how I can't do this um, until this evening. But it, that's okay. I mean, they say do it in the evening, so it kind of like works overnight. Um, so we'll do it tonight, and um, I'll let you know what my thoughts are on it. I did smell it. It doesn't really smell of anything. Um, my mum thinks there's a scent there. Um, but yeah, I, I didn't really notice any scent to it. So guys, this is just the kind of quick... Quick... Um, try on really of the skincare like I said I will do another um, video on the actual nukes mask that we got in I think it was this box yeah it was in the free box we got a nukes mask I just think in the free box it was more value for money I'm really looking forward to trying this out but I don't want to open it up um, not at this stage anyway I've got two open and then I really want to try this out as well it's um the purifying and smoothing um, mask so yeah that looks nice I might do both of them tonight you know um, 
saying that though you have to have a clean fresh face for this now i'll do this one tonight and then we'll do the mask another night um but yeah i'm really really looking forward to testing this baby out thank you for joining me today guys it really does mean a lot that you have if you've not already subscribed i would love it if you would join my little fam over here on youtube please like share comment and i will see you in the next one bye guys